Well, Maseko, I can tell you that we've established about 47 people have been affected by this eviction. I'm standing on Peter Mokaba Road at the moment, and I'm just going to give you a sense of what's happening outside. This has been the situation now for the past two days where the residents of this apartment block, which is just off to my right beyond uh, the fence that you're seeing here, you might be able to get a glimpse of it. That's where they've been living, some of them, for a few years. And two days ago, they were then removed from that building. It apparently received an eviction order, but it only gave them 10 days, really, to get their belongings together. And many people were not able to do that. As a result of that, all of their belongings were then taken out. Uh, you can see that they were placed here on the street. Some of them have already been, some of these items have already been damaged because the weather in Durban over the past two days has not been great. These families are now on either side of the road, on the pavements in fact. You can even see that uh, they're quite close to where, where the traffic is. I was told that there are also a number of children that were outside. There has been no shelter. They've been in the rain for the most part. Some of them have tried uh, in, in some areas around here. I think just off to my left, I can see that there's a little makeshift tent that's been put up there where uh, you know some of the items are covered, where some people have been trying to seek shelter. But for the most part, they've been out in the rain. I was also told that uh, among those that out here is a woman who is heavily pregnant. I believe she's eight or nine months pregnant. I'm just going to leave it there. I'll bring the, the councillor in. If you can just talk to us about, uh, you know, what kind of interventions uh, have been made. How are these people going to be assisted? I mean, I know that this is a now a legal matter with the property owner, but besides that, you have people now on the street, uh, and again, the weather looks like it's turning.